welcome everybody good afternoon and it's so so nice for everyone to be here thank you so much for taking the time to join this exhibitor webinar i do hope you've all had wonderful summer holidays or had a good summer and we are so ready to get started um thank you again for taking the time to be here with us today and we look forward to taking this opportunity to inform you of what's happening next and the exciting things that are coming up for the show. Kindly note that this presentation is to be recorded. Your video will not be seen, nor will your audio be shared. But then again, it will be shared on the exhibitor portal for you to review. And in any case, you do not wish for it to be recorded. You can exclude yourself from the presentation. Let's get started. This is the agenda that I'll guide you through today. Um, I'll give you a brief explanation of the Met Straight team. We'll look into the floor plan for the upcoming show. I'll guide you through the exhibitor portal, including any and all videos you might have, might or might not have seen. I'll show you about the web shop. I'll guide you through the events such as the Dame, as well as ELAB and Boat Builder. I'll show you a quick overview of all deadlines and practical information. And last but not least, we'll end this presentation with a Q&A. If you have any and all questions during this presentation, please put them in the Q&A and I'll answer them by the end of it. Um, let's get started. We'll top off with a, meet, a short little introduction of our team. Uh, this, is what, uh, this is our colleagues that we're currently working on for the Met Straight show. Um, we're all so excited to welcome you and we're, we'll be a total of 16 members with a lot of new energy and excitement and we cannot wait to welcome you in November and see, hopefully see most of you in person for the Met State Show. Looking into the floor plan, we're so excited to be, be, to be back on a 2019 level. We look forward to welcoming 1,400 exhibitors divided over a total of 26 national pavilions. Our Super Yacht Pavilion, which you'll find just right here, is completely sold out and we have limited availability in the Met Strait area. Um, in the middle of all the floor plans, you'll find a full focus on sustainability in the Elysium, in which we have the Dame Awards, the ELAB and the Met Strait Theatre, um, and we'll make sure that it's a very strategic uh, location for everyone to visit. We are aware that there are some significant changes and uh, we are very happy to, uh, that you have helped us guide through all of this. We know these changes aren't easy and thank you so much for all corporations you have, you, all your corporations so far. We look forward to welcoming everybody. This includes exhibitors and visitors back to this amazing show. I'll guide you through a bit of the quick changes that we have so far. We have on top of uh, hall one, we have our food court. We are not making use of hall seven this year. Um, we have used, we are using the extension of hall five on the right side. This includes the marina and yard pavilion and the sushi club. As mentioned, you'll find down here um, all the sustainability focus, Dame, ELAB and the Met Strait Theatre. And on the left side, you'll find the construction and material, material pavilion in Hall 12. For the Super Yacht Pavilion this year, we are using Hall 9, 10 and 11. This includes the Holland Yachting Group Bar in Hall 9. There will be an extra corridor between Hall 9 and Hall 11. There is a great um, enter from the Super Yacht Forum to Hall 9 and one of the great changes that we have for this year is that the catering which is coffee tea and fruit will be served from inside the halls instead of at your stand this so that all exhibitors can enjoy a fresh cup of cappuccino latte macchiato any specific coffee and we make sure that all fruits that are served are fresh and not any wastage will be uh, for this year in down here, once we have, once we are sharing the presentation, you'll find the links to the online floor plans as well, which are in real time. So you can see all the colleague exhibitors that'll be during that'll be there during the show. So I hope that everyone has entered their exhibitor portal. Um, you have received your login details via email. I just wanted to guide you through a bit of the portal today as everything is in this portal and in one place. Um, this portal helps you to prepare for your pre for your participation for the show. And it really has these four themes which are here right on the top. 
um, which will help you through any and all information. A great add-on for this exhibitor portal is the checklist. You can use this checklist to really tick off any and all action you've done so far, just to make sure that you are ready, set and go. As you can see here, we also would love to include you in all information that are very important, which is mentioned at the top. For example, this, exhib this exhibitor webinar, which is done today. There's a second one also on October 11th. So on the top right side here, you'll find in general information, all information about opening hours, about parking, or even terms and conditions if you want to review this on your part. Um, on your participation, you'll find information that you need to update on the company profile, for example, but you'll also find movies on stand construction, information or how to get to badges and logistics and permits, which is of course very important to know getting ready towards the show. On promotion, you'll find uh, how to invite your visitors. You'll find information about the Dame Awards. You'll find how to, or at least you'll be able to download the logo and banners and uh, information about visibility. So if you'd like to, for example, make use of a signature underneath your email, you can find this under promotion, download it straight away and use it to send emails to your visitors that you can invite for the show. And last but not least, under travel and stay, you'll find any and all information regarding hotel services, but also flight discounts. And if you need to uh, uh, apply for a visa, you can find information here as well. So this is most important about the exhibitor portal. Make sure you get ready uh, and you get familiar with the portal and you'll find a lot of information just right there. It's also got a search option right on the, on the top of the exhibitor portal in which you can search for any specific information if you wish to find it there. A great one I'd like to inform you on as we're getting ready is the promotions and visibility part. This is the way to stand out from the crowd. Uh, we've got some spectacular promotion opportunities going on and it's just a way to differentiate yourself from the crowd. There's still a lot of options available. You can find them on our website. Again, the link is here in the presentation, which we'll share with you and you'll find an overview of any and all possibilities. If you have any questions, do feel free to reach out to us or even to schedule a meeting just so we can inform you of, of the options so far. And uh, don't hesitate to get in contact with us and get for more information. Good to know is that the final deadline to apply for promotion visibility is the October 25th. Um, and you can reach us via metstraight at rye.nl. This is a time where I'd like to show you a bit about the videos that we've made. We have a new edition for this year. Um, I show you a total of four videos in which you can find every and all information, which is a great way to just get familiar, especially for the ones who are a first timer with us at MetStraight, but also for the ones who need a bit of a refresher on how did we do it all again and how did we get ready. Our exhibitor services team has made a few videos. This is the first one on the sand construction of Metstrade. I'll also show you how to do the sand construction on the Supiot Pavilion. And I'll show you a quick video of how to work with the stand layout form. Um, please feel free. I'll give you a few moments to see these videos and let us know if you can hear and see them correctly. Hi, we are excited to welcome you to the Metstrade show. In this video, we will show you what a standard booth package looks like. The standard booth package includes three chairs, one table, one desk, anthracite carpet tiles, and a lockable storage room in the right corner. You can indicate your booth preferences in the stand layout form, which you will receive by email. If you would like to know more about the stand layout, please check our instruction video on this item. If you are looking for ways to generate more exposure for your booth, please join us in the next video. Hi. This is the second one on Super Yacht Pavilion as well. Hi. We are excited to welcome you to the Super Yacht Pavilion at this year's Mets Trade Show. With this video, we would like to inform you about your standard package and what it looks like in its standard form. The storage room, furniture, and anthracite carpet are all included in your package. Would you like to adjust the layout? 
please use the stand layout form, which we explain in our Mets Trade stand layout form video. For more exposure, you can add graphics, extra furniture, plants, flowers, and AV to your stand, making it look like this. And last but not least, you're even able to arrange drinks and snacks for your guests. In case you wish to have a helping hand, please consider hiring a host. Hi. This is a video that shows you the extra possibilities that you can add on to your booth. Hi. We are excited to welcome you to the Mets Trade Show. In this video, we will show you the extra possibilities and items you can order for your booth. We have added wall graphics on each wall for maximum exposure, a TV screen for company presentations and video conference, a plant and refreshments to attract extra visitors. In case you wish to have a helping hand, please consider hiring a host. Are you interested in a stand like this? Please visit our web shop. In the web shop, you can order everything you see here and much more. Thank you so much, and we are looking forward to welcoming you to Mets Trade. Hi. And last but not least, we have a video on the stand layout form, uh, which I'll guide you to you a little bit further with the next slide. Hi. We are excited to welcome you to the Mets Trade Show. In this video, we will explain you more about the stand layout form. Every exhibitor at Mets Trade will receive a booth package. A standard booth package looks like this. We'd like to help you prepare for the show and explain you more about the stand layout form and the standard stand package. In case you have a deluxe or royal package, your stand layout form will be updated accordingly. <clears throat> In the stand layout form, you can indicate your preferences for your stand. We'll start with the fascia board. This is where your company name will be displayed. In case you would like to change the company name, please inform the Mets Trade team at metstrade at rai.nl. The standard carpet color is anthracite, but in case you prefer a different color, you're able to select different options here. Let us now have a look at the booth layout. Each booth package includes a one square meter storage room. Please indicate if you would like the storage room, and if so, what shape and where you would like it to be located. Next stop is your furniture. Each booth has one desk, three chairs, and one table included. It's up to you to decide if you would like it all or just a selection. Exhibitors that have royal and deluxe booths have the option to upload the logo for their desk or carpet tile in the stand layout form as well. Finally, in the last step, you can confirm your booth layout by clicking here. After this, you will receive a confirmation email in which you can find the link to our web shop and a link to order graphics for your booth. Please make sure to complete the standard layout form before the deadline to ensure that you receive the booth you prefer. Stand layout forms received after the deadline will automatically receive the standard stand layout, which is anthracite carpet tiles, a storage room of one square meter in the corner, all furniture. Please join us in the next video for more information on your booth and ways to make a lasting impact on your visitors. Hi. So I'm hoping these videos helped you a little bit just to get familiarized with all Metstreet preparations. I just wanted to dive a bit more into the stand layout form. This form was sent on September 5th, uh, last Monday. And do look into, I encourage you to look into your spam folders or your junk email or with any of your colleagues who've previously exhibited with us at Metstreet to see if they have received the stand layout form so far. If not, if you check all of these options please feel free to reach out to us as well if you haven't received it so we can resend it to you to make sure that you have got it so as mentioned uh, the company name will be you will be sent in this fascia board on the stand layer form we'll look into the location of the lockable storage we'll look into the color of the carpet tiles and we'll look into the location of the electrical fittings um which is uh, an add-on is that the graphics for the back wall of the stand will also be 
uh, put into the stand layer form just to make sure that it's all ready and set for you to go and the quality is a good one to start. So that's so far on the stand layout form. Um, we'll look into the web shop a little bit as well. Um, you can log into the web shop via the exhibitor portal um, and you'll receive an email with a login. If you have any problems, feel free to reach out to our exhibitor services team who can help you to get into the web shop and to make sure that you can um, order anything that you need in or at your stand. So you can order services such as catering, meeting rooms, any internet in connections any internet connections you might need, any water connections you might need during your show, the graphics, extra graphics, we look into TV and monitors, we look into hostesses, plants and flowers, so any and all themes, they're right within one click away with the web shop and payments can be done directly through the web shop as well, which is a great way to make sure that you have everything that you need to get started or to have a great um, service during the show. Looking into what's happening at Metstrade, the upcoming show in November, we have, it wouldn't be a Metstrade without the Dame Awards. It's the industry's most prestigious awards. Um, there's one award to be presented in multiple categories to be awarded. This includes special mentions as well. The jury takes factors into account, such as sustainability of the product um, and for its intended purpose, but also the level of innovation and cost. So this year's jury, a total of nine members, includes, of course, the chair member, Andre Hook, and the secretary, Kim Hollenby. And we are very happy that entries are coming in. The final deadline is the 16th of September, and the winner of the Dame Design Award will be announced on the 15th of November during the breakfast briefing. If you want to enter your products, please do so via the exhibitor portal uh, so we can make sure that all entries are coming in. Another theme uh, we have during the Metro is the ELAP Electric and Hybrid Showcase, which has a full focus on the climate friendly propulsion. Uh, we were tapping into the growing demand for the hybrid and electric engi engines in the market. And we offer our exhibitors a unique way to show their product in a dedicated space, which is right in the middle, as mentioned, the strategic location. Um, what happens is that the exhibitors can show their products and only their products uh, for everyone to see. Um, and it doesn't allow any um, extra people to be with the products, which gives you a direct connection to your stand at the Metstrade show floor. Um, and it allows visitors to really focus on the product and it really helps them gather their interest into what's going on. Um, our colleague has already been in contact with the companies who he whom he believes are eligible for the ELAB, but please, I invite you to also look into if you're, uh, ready and if you want to join the ELAB showcase in the Elysian Ballroom. Um, the deadline is the same as with the Dame Awards, the 16th of November and latest we have, we get, we gather all entries and we gather them through applying at metstraight at right.nl. Another great theme is the Boat Builder Awards for this year. They take place on Tuesday, the 15th of November in Amsterdam at Scheepsvaart Museum. Um, it would be amazing to make sure that the exhibitors, to get their products recognized. Um, there's a total of 10 categories in which entries can be nominated, and they vary from innovation to environmental responsibility, as well as marketing and personal achievements. So entry for the Boat Builder Awards is free and open to all boat builders, shipyards, manufacturers of leisure boats and superyards, or for some categories, those who are employed by them. Nominations can be done by anyone in the marine industry. And I'd like to encourage you very much to spread the word and to make sure that important work is recognized during the Boat Builder Awards. Um, you can find all entry tips on the website from IBI. There's a link included in the presentation as well. And all entries are closed on September 28th. I uh, wanted to take this opportunity to guide you through any and all important deadlines. These, again, can be found in the exhibitor portal, which can be checked right away. Uh, there's a lot upcoming for this month in September, so please make sure to add them into your agenda. Um, there's deadlines for the Dame and ELAB, but there's also uh, um, some deadlines for the stand in stand construction by the end of September. Again, in October, there's a few that are very important for you to note as we're getting ready one month for Metstrade. 
um, for example, the stand layout form for the 17th of October, but also your graphics and uh, any and all discount that you might still want on power and staff. Um, by the end of October, there's the deadline for the media solutions and the beginning of November, there's two last deadlines and then we are almost getting ready. So here's some practical information I wanted to guide you through as well. So the early decoration period will be announced very soon and we'll let you know as soon as we have that. It will be in the uh, exhibitor portal as well. So for the normal decoration period, we start on Sunday the 13th of November and Monday the 14th. Our show will be open Tuesday to Thursday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. and Thursday to 5. And we have a dismantling period from Tuesday, Thursday the 17th of November until 11.30 p.m. and Friday as well to 12. So our location, of course, known by you is Rye Amsterdam, and we're using halls 1 to 6 and 12 for Met Strait, halls 9 to 11 for the super yacht. Marina and Yard Pavilion will be located in the lower part of Hall 5, and of course, the construction material pavilion in Hall 12. Please note that approval is needed for any and all early decorations, and you can send an email to exhibitor services at ride.nl uh, from mid-October onwards. So don't do it just yet. From the mid of October, you can approve, you can ask for approval for early decorations. Another one for practical information is the badges, because of course you need them during build-up and breakdown times and during the exhibitions themselves. Rye Amsterdam can only be added, entered with a valid badge, and please find the overview here, again, in the exhibitor portal as well, to make sure what kind of badge you need and if there are any safety rules that you might have that there might apply when you enter Rye, for example, during the early decorations or the dismantling period. Find them in the exhibitor portal, review them, and if you have any questions from example stand builders, please get them uh, the information that they need just to make sure that we are all ready and set to go. Another one is the logistic management system. So we work with um, a system to easily reserve a time slot for all freight deliveries so they can uh, easily get in and get out at the reserved time. Please make sure to reserve their time if freight deliveries are coming in so that they can make sure when they need to arrive and when they need to access, as this is more managed via, via, via the reservation system. Uh, this is a new one for some of the exhibitors, so please read into this. And again, any extra information is to be found in the exhibitor portal. You can reserve this time slot from the 19th of October onwards from 4 p.m. Uh, so no need to reserve this already from the 19th of October. You're able to do so. So this is a quick overview of who to contact when, because of course there's different fees and different subjects. Um, so for the stand layout form, graphics, and you know, ordering the web shop, stand construction, badges, please redirect your question to exhibitor services. Um, they can help you straight away and we make sure that the right questions is answered at the right team. Same goes for us or so our MedStray team. You can contact us for any information about your stand location, um, about DAME or eLab, but also about promotion visibility. And of course, we are already looking into the rebook for, 20 and 20, for 2023. So look into that with our team as well. This is a bit of what we uh, wanted to know, what we wanted you to know getting ready for MetStrade. Um, let's open the Q&A and let's see what the questions are. As let's see if I can find them. So I have no open questions so far. Please take a minute to send them if you have them. Um, I'll take a few extra minutes of, your, of this time for the presentation. Um, send them straight away if you have any questions. And other than that, I hope that everything's been clear so far and that we were able to help you get through, get ready for Met Straight. So even if it's just, if you want to comment on something or if you have any extra information, maybe you found something on the uh, exhibitor portal you want to mention, feel free to put them. Thank you so much. <laughs> it was lovely <laughs> get, make, doing the presentation for you. I hope it helped um, and I hope you uh, enjoyed this presentation. I'll give it a moment or two. And other than that, there's nothing else from my side. Let's look at my colleagues if they have anything extra to add. All right, thank you so much. 
you know where to find us, you know any and all contact information, we'll share this presentation with you in the exhibitor portal. Um, I'll also make sure to add, we'll also make sure to add all links to make sure you have this information at hand. Thank you so much for being with me today. I hope this was a, uh, an informative um, session and we look forward to welcoming you in November. Thank you very much. Goodbye.